I, I would have been satisfied if we had tracked the whole chain of possession from the burglars to the recovery with Justin Van Roekel. I, I feel like uh, I'm not satisfied because we never, we lost that one step. I really believe that there's one person who possessed the gun in between Teddy Barrera and Francisco Echeverria. You know, I don't work for the West Jordan Police Department, but this, this case has affected me too. Like I, anytime there's an officer homicide, I think about this case. And uh, no, in my, in my heart of hearts, I, I think we did what we could to um, figure out how he got that gun. And we just were one step away from figuring it out.